Child development is an amazing process. There are times when your baby's brain is ready to develop certain skills. You can help your baby learn these new skills. Your baby will learn best from you. The brain seems to be set up to uh, engage in certain systems at certain ages. So, for example, uh, very early on we're learning about how to feel safe in relationships. If we don't get that early on, it's much harder to get it later on. The experiences we have early on are a foundation for what comes later on. So it's important to get those things in early so that they form a good foundation, don't have to be reworked later, and our later steps are easier. To give you an example of, of how that's important, if I get a good sense of security in my first year to 18 months, by the time I get to school, I'm not stressed so much. I can handle stress better. I can learn better as a result. My, my marks in school will be better. I'll be more ready to deal with the other kids in school. Later on, I'll be a better parent. So these things build on each other. Brain connections for seeing and hearing develop early. It's important to talk, sing, and read to your baby in the first three months of life. Tractors work on the farm all year round. There are so many different jobs to do. Point to interesting things and to moving objects. Do you see it? There's a window of opportunity for learning to talk between one and two years of age. It continues for many years. Language skills need to be put in place as early as possible. Babies can hear and recognize their parents' voices in the womb. Hey, my little princess. How are you doing there? Are you okay? It's important to talk to your baby even before birth and to do it often in the first years of life. This will help your baby learn to talk. Later on, your baby will learn to do more complicated tasks, such as working with symbols. Again, this learning starts much earlier. You can help by playing with your baby in the first few years of life. Mm. A baby green block. A baby green block. What's the shape of it? Oh, a triangle. A triangle, that's right. It's probable that, that there are building blocks for literacy and numeracy in the early interactions that occur. So for example, when, when a mom or a dad are talking to a baby, they're actually also teaching the baby about taking turns. They're teaching the baby about sequences. They're teaching the baby about consequences. This comes first, that comes later. Those are all parts of understanding language, of understanding numbers, and how those systems work. So those are the basic building blocks. While all children develop in their own ways, there are common patterns of development. Your healthcare provider can help you learn more about this. If you think your child may have a delay in their development, Talk to your healthcare provider as soon as possible. When your child is 18 months, visit your healthcare provider to discuss your child's development. Early help is important as there are times when your baby is more ready to learn certain skills. If there are delays, it may be harder to learn some skills later on. Sometimes children need the help of a specialist to deal with these delays. It's important to recognize if children cannot hear or cannot see well. Uh, if you don't understand that, if you don't recognize it, then children's behavior can be confusing for parents. They don't know why the child isn't responding. You can make other kinds of diagnoses that miss the mark. For example, a child who doesn't hear might look as if he has some kind of a relational difficulty like autism or something like that, but in fact he doesn't. Uh, what he needs are special ways of being approached so that he can engage in, in the uh, interactions with parents effectively.